Hey guys, this is Matt from Brushless RC Motor. Just want to go ahead and continue the build on my Duratrax Vader EXT2. Uh, if you look at my last video, you'll see I already swapped out the tranny and diff gears to metal uh, for the brushless setup coming up, but this is still the stock brushed motor. I'm going to go ahead and run a quick uh, couple of test drives on it. Uh, then I'm going to go ahead and slap on my new brushless motor, uh, rated at 3930 kV and we will see what the difference is between the two. All right, see you guys outside. Okay, unfortunately that's about top speed as far as the uh, brush truck goes here. You'll see what I mean. That's about as fast as this thing will go. Okay guys, here's the uh, new brushless setup uh, before I put the wheel back on. Uh, I've got the stock spur gear, which is an 88 tooth spur, and I went ahead and changed the pinion out to a 24 tooth uh, aftermarket pinion I found. Um, I'm going to go ahead at one point and upgrade everything to 32 pitch gears. I uh, just have to get some parts together in order to do that. And uh, that's because, of course, uh, although I like uh, this setup fine, uh, I'm going to go with a higher torque version later on down the road. So I'm going to have to make sure my gears will stand up to it. Anyways, here's the, uh, the motor installed. Uh, nothing too crazy. Got the Mamba Max speed controller up here. And uh, all I have to do is go reprogram it now to uh, run brushless. And pop the wheel on, and we should be ready to go on the next set of runs. Now this is only on an 8.4 volt pack, so this could do a lot more than this. I could take this up to a 3 cell LiPo, which I will, but I wanted to show you guys the difference between the brush and the brushless.